I'm Brother Vince, and I'm a disabled Army veteran. Today, I want to talk to you about my top 10 benefits for disabled veterans. But before we get into that, please like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel, Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn for more content. And if you're a veteran and would love to share your stories or resources for veterans, please feel free to contact me so we can schedule a meeting ASAP. Now that I've gotten that good information out of the way, please, please, with some of these on my top 10, please check your state for some of the state benefits because I'm in Texas. So my top 10 benefits for disabled veterans start with number one, GovX. My number two, Vet Ticks. And now my number three, Shades of Green. My number four, ID Me. My number five, Wounded Warrior Project. My number six, I Hoop. My number seven, Operation Homefront. My number eight, the Texas Veterans Commission. My number nine, the Texas Veterans Portal. And my number 10, Veterans United. And to give you a bonus, my last one would be, if it was a number 11, would be VA.gov. GovX is an actual website where you can get from apparel to rental cars. Also, you can get discounted price. Um, you can get rental on uh, rental cars. You can get discounted prices on your rental cars. You can get hotels, flights. You can get trips to theme parks. When I say GovX has it all, GovX has it all. With number two, vet ticks. Vet ticks is just what it said. Ticks, tickets. You can go there and you can get tickets to plenty of events for free. Yes, I said it for free. Shades of green. Now, I want you to have to take this disclaimer that I'm putting out. With Shades of Green, you have to be a 100% disabled veteran from my knowledge. I haven't been on the site in a while, so I'm not sure if they extended it to all veterans. But when I went, it was only those who are 100% were allowed to go to Shades of Greens. What is Shades of Green? It's an actual hotel that's located on Disney property. So if you parents have kids that you want to take to Disney or you want to take them to Universal Studios or any of the other places, you can do this and you can do this at a good, affordable price. Just register with Shades of Green if you're 100%. ID Me. ID Me is basically a site for law enforcement, for, um, if I'm not mistaken, healthcare workers, students, all of these people, man. If you have an ID that you want to register so that you can get discounts for it um, different websites. And as a veteran, you can use IDME to help you. And also, um, IDME allows you to sign in va.gov, gov, or you can also sign um, up for, um, you can use it for your Social Security benefits if you need to log into that site. Number five, again, was Wounded Warrior Project. Wounded Warrior Project is not just for veterans who have been wounded physically. Mental wounds are wounds also, and they allow you to use their sources to do so many different things. Like my wife and my son, I watched them actually play bingo online. I also saw my wife have meetings where they gave her pizza for free. Also, we got tickets to the movie theaters to see events where they feed us. Um, I also found out about this because of another veteran. She got tickets for the Texas Rangers through Wounded Warrior Project. And what was so cool about it was she didn't even have to pay for her food. Now, with vet ticks, you have to pay for the extra. But with Wounded Warrior Project, you don't. iHoot. Now, iHoot is a cool feature um, that I haven't used yet. Reason being is because the list for people wanting to get free trips is very long and extensive. And they actually have a date stating that by September of this year, you have to have already registered for your trip. Operation Finally Home. This is a cool organization because they build homes for veterans for guess what? Free. Free. Now, there may be certain criteria that you have to actually um, meet in order for this to happen. But just know that if you're a veteran looking for a home and you're struggling and you're going through 
whatever is going on and you just can't afford to, Operation Finally Home is one of those places that you may need to hit up. Number eight, remember I told you in the beginning, some of these benefits are for those in Texas. Go to Texas Veteran Commission. Now, in my description, I have an actual link for those who are start for those veterans who are starting a new veteran um owned business. They have a pre qualification process that I found on there, and I put that in the description for y'all. They're a cool place to go if you need anything as far as being a veteran in Texas. And then number nine was Texas Veteran Portal. Again, this portal allows you to see every benefit that we as Texans have. Again, you have to be in Texas. Now, if you want to move to Texas and receive some of these benefits, man, remember, Texas is on the top of that, on that top 10 list for places for veterans. And then number 10, Veterans United. The reason why number 10 is Veteran United, why I put them on my list, because I remember I was looking for a home. I didn't have much money for a home. I had some money, but not enough money. Well, when I used Veteran United, because of my situation as a 100% disabled veteran, I was able to get a home without a down payment. And in actuality, because of what was going on at the time, I actually received money back, which was pretty cool. And right now, from what I see, they have this thing going on to where a veteran can win a prize of $100,000 for signing up with Veteran United now. And of course, the bonus, VA.gov. If you're trying to apply for benefits, if you have questions about disability, and all other things that you may have going on as far as wanting to get education. Um, you may be looking to try to figure out how much um, time you have to wait before you hear something about your case that you have you know, filed for um, with the VA. VA.gov is the place to go for all of your veteran needs. Now that all that's out the way, man, and you got all that great information, don't sit down and not take advantage of these opportunities. This has been another episode with your boy, brother Vince of Vet Talk.